This is an example of what a profile could look like. Keep in mind that they will all look different depending on the information available. There's a space for a photograph. A contact form will be on every profile so that anyone can contact you with a subject message and their information. There's a space for links. You can add a Google Scholar link, a Twitter or X link, LinkedIn. If you have a Scopus author ID, you can have a link to your profile. Your title will be visible underneath your name, as well as uh, your faculty status and your department or program information. On the right, you'll see other icons so that people can search for you on a variety of social media sites. Scrolling down to see the full profile overview, this information will depend on what you make available. In this example, there is an about section. There is also a CV linked, and you'll see that the links up top for Google and a website are also below where the CV is. This is where your research interests and disciplines will also be displayed. You can scroll down to the bottom of the page to see the other content types available, or click the other categories like scholarship or press and media to sort through the content that way. Since each faculty member is associated with a department or a program or a school, if you click that link, you'll be brought there to see other faculty members affiliated with the same area. What's nice is there's a hierarchy in the system. So if I go into research units and education, you can see that education falls under the School of Education and Human Services. Once I'm there, when I click profile, I will see all of the profiles affiliated with the School of Education and Human Services. You can see Chandler's profile right here. That's the one we were just looking at. But you will also see other profiles for other departments and programs underneath this school, such as social work and education. So this was just one example of what a profile could look like, depending on the content. And the four content areas are scholarship, activities, honors and awards, and press and media. And that personal overview area depends on what you decide to make available.